you guys earn here. In time, I'm doing 50 pulls from the syringe tokens wheel. Now, I did 21 pulls before. I'm at about just about 7,000 bloody shirts. Didn't get any tunes. So I figured the odd the odd drops for the bloody shirts aren't like horrible. So why not go for more pulls? And I just hit a thousand subscribers, which is pretty awesome. So you know, why not? Because I know everyone loves the token wheel pulls on whatever wheel it is, whatever random wheel scope we adds into the game. Obviously, people love seeing pulls being done, so why not? A thousand subscribers is pretty awesome, so thank you guys for that. 50 pulls here. There's an offer to get 38,000 tokens, which is 38 pulls, for $39.99. It's Canadian, so I bought that one. And then there was another like bag thing you can buy in the featured section, which was like 69 coins. There's a 50-50 chance of getting either 100 tokens or 2,000 tokens. So I bought that a couple of times. So I got the, I, think, I don't know how many times exactly I bought it. But I got the rest of the 12 pulls that I needed for the 50 from that. You can see there I have 700 extra tokens. Because I pulled 100 seven times. So I bought it a couple of times. I, I can't remember the exact amount, but probably around between somewhere between like 10 and 15 i guess like i don't even know but anyways doing this poll because one i went dr stevens hit a thousand subscribers so that's awesome and also the trainers i realized i ran out of trainers basically like i had a bunch of five star trainers from the pathways event that was like i don't know how long ago that was now but i'm running out slowly i only have like maybe like 25 star trainers left or something like that or even less so you, so hopefully I can pull Dr. Steven straight up in this wheel and then I can use the rest of the bloody shirts to get trainers. It's, it's only 2,000 tokens to get train the, the one crate where you can get like 10 Benedicts or a chance at 10 Benedicts. So hopefully I can just pull the Dr. Steven straight up and the rest of the bloody shirts can go to trainers. But we'll see. Maybe I'll just end up spending all the bloody shirts on trainers. Who knows? Because what's more important, the trainers or a six-star tune right now? Even if the six star tune could still be useful, I don't know. Let's go for this pull here. Again, 1% chance to get five star sendable, 99% chance to get the collection item. The highest amount we pulled last time was 2,500 bloody shirts, which isn't horrible. You do need 20,000 to get Dr. Stevens, though, if you want the guaranteed Dr. Stevens, or you can just pull them straight up. Let's go for the first 10 here, though. Come on, just give me Dr. Stevens straight up. And like, oh damn, 103, 126, another 123. Hey, how they do the such random numbers? There's a thousand, that's not bad. Like 68, why not just make a 70? Like, why you, like, so weird. They do it with like every, every wheel, every collection item. Okay, not horrible. Well, I mean, it's not great either. Roughly a little bit under 2,000, I'd say. Next 10, here we go. Come on, game, just give me Dr. Stevens, and I can get trainers. 750. At the rate we're going right now, we're definitely not going to be hitting the 20,000. But it's not the end of the world, because at least I can buy those trainers. We only got 30 more pulls. This isn't looking good so far. I don't know. This is going to be 71 pulls in total after I do these 50. I mean, I've been using free coins to get all these pulls. Besides, well, obviously I used the $39.99 offer for this one. So it's not like this was expensive or anything. Oh, let's go. We got Dr. Stevens. Let's go. I like how the bloody shirt has the six star logo next to it thank god we pulled this man thank the lord now i could just get trainers or i could even get a second dr stevens if i really wanted to okay this is definitely worth it then 39.99 for dr stevens i'll take it let's go and we still have 20 pulls to go I mean, what if i just double up on dr stevens who knows I already have two Mercers. I don't need another Mercer, but I wouldn't even mind having two Dr. Stevens. Let's see here. 
That, the rest of it's just icing on the cake now. Everything else is just extra. It still has the six star logo next to everything that's coming up. So we're owed 2,500 in our pad. 67s and okay, now we're getting like low amounts. Come on. Give me like at least two more 2,500s and I'll be happy. Well, I'm already happy, I can't even complain. Last 10 pulls. Okay, this was definitely worth it. I'm pretty happy now. Definitely worth it. It's because I spent money on these pulls. I got put into the good bucket and Scopely gave me the good odds. I think that's what happened. Fifty-three, come on. Give me some more, please. Oh, we got Mercer now too. I don't need that's my third Mercer. I don't really need him, but I guess I'll take him. Not bad. Two ascendables, a bunch of shirts. Overall, this pool was a success, I think. I'd say at least. For sure. I got Dr. Stevens and now I have a bunch of trainers I can get. So let me know in the comments below. This is definitely the last pull I'm doing for this wheel. Unless they end up giving like free tokens away. But like, they haven't been. It'd be nice if they did this a wheel like this every week. Where like the pulls are decently cheap. But like the thing is they'd have to give away tokens for free. Like maybe do like a roadmap along with the wheel where you can get like 10 free pulls or something from a wheel like this. Like just it doesn't have to be like a, for like an S class tune, just like a nice six star like this, like Dr. Stevens still a solid tune. Wouldn't be mad at it if they did it every week. And I think they make decent money off of this because the odds aren't like completely horrible. Unlike most other wheels that they put out. But then the one thing they need to do, and this kind of annoys me, is ninety nine percent chance for collection items, yeah, but like what are the odds for the certain amount? That's what they need to add in. That's super annoying that they don't do that. They do that with like all the S class like bags too, like the roadmap bags and that kind of stuff. Super annoying. Well, or some of the S class bags. Most of them are you can choose now, but whatever. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think of this pull. What do you guys get if anyone did any pulls for this? Thanks for watching, and thank you guys for a thousand subscribers. It's awesome. Peace.